It's not. It's... Yeah, no. Yeah, no, it's not. Are you from Boston? No. Tell us anything about the album. Okay, so what I can tell you about the album is it basically is kind of like just a summary of my last six months in L.A. So it's basically just like runs through like everything that I've been going through, like piece by piece, which is kind of crazy because if I like actually release it, it's going to be like legit my diary, which is weird. Um... I feel like you're a water sign. I actually have no idea what what are what cancers. Are those? I feel like those are like sand, not <laughs> not sand. What are what are cancers? They're like um like earth signs. Who's your dream collab? My dream collab will forever and always be Post Malone and. You guys know that. I literally talk about him so much. And the problem is, is I've been, like, getting more and more addicted to him. Like, I've been listening to his music, like, 24-7. Yes, those are water signs. I'm a cancer. (laughs) Guys, I'm not a water sign. I'm a sand sign. (laughs) It's a new category I created. (laughs) Uh... Fave Post Malone song. Okay, do you know what's a really underrated Post Malone song? Is A Thousand Bad Times. I really don't think that that song got enough appreciation. Are you seeing Caitlyn and Addison for Super Bowl weekend? Um, probably. (laughs) Um, um, what was I gonna say? A Thousand Bad Times is such a good song, and... No one ever talks about it because it just didn't get the recognition that it deserved. Okay? Okay? What was working with Troy Sivan like? Troy Sivan is an angel. And, um, he's just, like, the coolest guy ever. He's so pretty, too. (laughs) Um... This album will literally end me. (laughs) Don't say that. Uh, but there are some sad songs on it for sure. Um, I feel like sh- is dope. Thank you. I appreciate it. Um, the Weeknd. The Weeknd is also one of my favorite artists. I will say that his last album I liked better than this one. But probably just because, you know how, like, you associate albums and, like, music with, uh, like, different times in your life? I just feel like I was, like, really, that whole period of my life, I was listening to his album, like, 24-7. So, that is one of my favorite albums. Drop us a hint on what you filmed. Okay, it's a campaign. I'll say that. It's a campaign, and it's for something that, uh... Is really cool. And I think you guys are going to be like... Like, it's something that I was like, oh shit, I can't believe this is happening. It was like, cool. <laughs> In my eyes. Thoughts on Billy? I think she's incredible. And her concerts look insane right now. Stop, I love you. Hi, Elena. I love That Way so much. It's a song that made me discover. Mm. That Way is my little baby. I have It's so funny because I remember exactly what I wrote that about and who I wrote that about. And I was in grade 10. And I just remember it was like such a distinct feeling. Like why I was like so... I was so in my feels about this one person. And fuck, I wrote so many songs. Give me some songs I should listen to right now. Hi, Kale. Hello. Happy birthday to Kaylee. Happy birthday. 
You're pretty. I love you. What's your favorite song? Uh, my favorite song right now. I've been listening to. This is depressing. I've been listening to Juice World again. I've been going back to the basics. I've been listening to. <laughs> Little Peep. Uh. I've been listening to X. I've been listening to Juice World. I've been listening to Post Malone. Frank Ocean. Borrowed Love by Sway Lee. Tate, listen to NF. Guys, I went through a phase in my life where I was obsessed with NF. And that was all I would listen to because he was my favorite ever. They're all legends. Honestly, I feel like there's just, like, times in your life, especially in, like, January and February, or, like, September and October, where, like, you just need to listen to artists like that, and then it's, like, when summer comes, it just, like, your mentality changes. But when it's, like, the depressing months, those are my people. What about Chase Atlantic? I honestly haven't gotten into him very much. I just know his songs from uh, TikTok. But he sound or they I think it's a band they sound incredible. Um, do you have a tour set list already? I think we have like kind of a tour set list, but I'm not really sure. I'm not really sure if it's gonna be like solidified yet. I just can't wait for she's all I want to be, because I think that that's gonna be. <laughs> Don't make fun of me. Um. Because I just think you guys are going to be able to jump, and that's going to be so fun. I just need that in my life real bad. Okay. Yeah, I listen to Taylor Swift. I listen to Taylor Swift a lot in the summer, though, because she's like a screamer. You know what I mean? Like, her songs are like screamers. You know what I mean? Uh... Na, 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 na. Are you nervous for tour? Guys, I'm so nervous. But I think what's, like, getting me excited is, like... Like, I'm, like, nervous because I have to, like... I'm bringing my dancers, and I'm doing, like, so many dates. And I'm going to be leaving L.A. for, like, months. But I'm, like, kind of... I just, like, can't wait to see you guys again. Like, that's... I think that's going to make everything worth it. I th- I think that'll take away all the nerves, if I'm being honest. Did you record any YouTube songs album? I didn't. I did not. I'm walking to the... open to the floor. You're pretty. Mm. Um... Are you working on the album while on tour? I think I should be done. By the time I get on tour, I'm my I think my album's done. I literally have like sixteen songs right now that I'm kinda just narrowing down into an album. And then I basically just like have to pick the next couple singles, which I like it's scary because I'm basically doing it like all on my own, which is like I don't know, nerve wracking. And I keep changing my mind. I literally keep changing my mind. Um but I think I think the album's, like, the whole thing of it is, like, done, which is at least, like, the most, you know, relaxing part. So I'm like, okay, I've, like, done all the writing, and I've done all the work, and I've put in, like, a million hours in the studio. It's now just, like, putting it into a thing. You know? February 11th. Yeah. February 11th. Music video. Get ready. Thank you. My eyes look very hazel right now. They change a lot. Like, sometimes they're, like, super brown. Sometimes they're... Are your songs based on your own relationships? A hundred percent. Everything on my album is... Everything I write is based on my own life. Always. I I think Except a Rubber Band wasn't based on my own life. But, um... my, My, like, new songs, everything I've written recently... Is all about.
Drop your skincare, girl. Okay. This sounds really annoying, but, like, I need to get on a skincare routine so bad. And I don't know how to do it because I'm really scared that if I start using skincare products that it's going to, like, break me out. Because I feel like it's, like, fine right now. You know what I mean? But I just use water. Right now. Oh, hi, Ava. I miss you. I love you. I'm obsessed with you. Nah, bro, I'm the same way. <laughs> yeah, like, sometimes I think I think water is a, a great thing. I put on moisturizer, 100%. My skin is dry as hell. My scare was... Yeah, exactly. I feel like if I started something crazy and started, like, taking time out of my day, it might just fuck it all up, you know? But I do wear sunscreen and I do wear moisturizer, so... But guys, I, um, you guys need to stay tuned for my music video dropping on Friday. Please watch, because it's really, I'm so proud of it, and I came up with this whole idea, we like, we were like taking so long to brainstorm, and like, I feel like it's just my visions like kind of coming to life, which is really exciting. So, I really hope you guys stay tuned, it's on Friday, and, um, yeah. I love you guys. Thank you so much for all the support on She's All I Want to Be. I can't believe it was, like, number one in Canada. And, you know, whatever happened to it, that's crazy. But I love you guys. Mwah. Good night.